Hey guys, it's Tiffany from supereasymath.com. Today's math problem of the day says simplify 18 over 16. Well, this is a really basic problem, but a lot of math problems that are more complicated ask you to simplify your answer at the end, and sometimes students mess up their whole problem just because they did this one step wrong. Well, whenever we're looking at a fraction, we wanna find a number that can go into both the numerator and the denominator when we're simplifying, and I can see right off the bat that 18 can go into both. So I can write 18 here and here, and that would equal one over two or one half. Sometimes you can't see right off the top of your head larger numbers that can go into both the numerator and the denominator. So you might need to start with a smaller number like two. You might say two can go into both 18 and 36. And so that would change it into nine over 18. Then after looking at that, you could say, oh, well, three can go into both. So nine divided by three is three and 18 divided by three is six. And then I can see that three can go into both of those. So then I know that it's one half again. So no matter what number you choose to divide them into both your numerator and denominator, as long as the number can go into both, you're gonna end up with the correct answer. Here's tomorrow's math problem of the day. See if you can solve it before I do. And don't forget to head over to supereasymath.com where you can get a live math tutor who can help you with all your math needs.